Hey guys, it's Leah. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be on the new Wet n Wild Spring Collection. It's called Spring into the Wild. Um, first off, can I say it's been like five or six weeks since I filmed a video and I'm so excited to be back filming. Um, it's been a rough month, but we're doing better. Faith's doing better. She's still home. Hopefully, um, she'll be good to go back to work. So, anyway, back to the video. Um, I saw this collection in Walgreens a few weeks ago, and I decided, one or two weeks ago, and I decided to pick it up. I picked up everything except for one, um, and I will show you. So, what it is, is um, you have three geometric highlighting powders to eyeshadow palettes this is what started this i saw this on wet n wild's instagram page weeks ago and it was beautiful and so this was what started the hunt for this collection then you also have you have three eyeliners a white a blue and a pink um i didn't pick up the pink i didn't think i would actually ever use it so I just got these two. And then also in the collection are four nail polishes. That is a total collection. So I'm just gonna show you a swatch of each one and my thoughts on them. So this is the packaging of the products, just in a white case. This one is called Where the Dreamers Go. These also include a little brush. It is a very cool, cool toned highlighter. Now these highlighters aren't for if you want like bam, like this. Um, I have this on underneath. These are very soft, subtle, glowy highlighters. I've been wearing these to work more than when I just want like, wow, look at that glow. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know if you'll be able to pick it up on camera. It's just a very glowy, very pretty cool toned highlighter. The next one in the collection is called Desert Explorations. And I also like when you rub your fingers together, it doesn't mix the colors. They stay in their own. They are a little hard. You do have to work a little bit more, but they're gorgeous. This one is a little bit more pink toned, a little more rosy still gorgeous glowy highlighter the next highlighter in this collection is called sun ceremony and it is just a gorgeous very gold warm highlighter it's just absolutely beautiful so this highlighter is a lot more yellow like true yellow gold it's a little too much on my fair skin. Someone with darker skin tones, olive skin tones, someone in that. This would look really pretty, but for me, this one is not gonna work so well. So I will be passing it on to someone who could actually use this. So these are just heavy swatches of them. This is the white, the more pink, and the more yellow. And this is what they look kind of blend it out on your hand. And these lights are kind of washing them out. So I would say if you see these out, pick one up, see what you think about it. Um, especially if you love a softer highlight, they're really good for that. They are $4.99 at Walgreens. Um, I think that's the only place that's carrying these. I'm not 100% sure, but that's where I got these. So $4.99. Next in the collection is the Wet n Wild Color Icon Eyeshadow Trio. These are gorgeous. I love these. I can say I love this one a little bit better. This is the New Romantics. This is the one I saw the swatches of and wanted to have. This other one is called Two Indio I Go Go. So in this one you get um, a champagne color um, a satin purple and then a blue shimmer. These are gorgeous. They are the typical wet and wild, just absolutely beautiful colors. Great formula. 
I was really impressed. Oh, you can see the the purple is not that great, but the gold, the yellow in here is just absolutely beautiful. And the blue, I really want to do an eyeshadow look with the blue, even though I am just kind of scared. I may just like put it on the lower lash line one day. But yes, I think those are absolutely gorgeous. Now the purple, even with a heavy swatch, it doesn't show up so well. Um, but the other colors are just absolutely beautiful. The other eyeshadow trio in here is called the New Romantics. It is just absolutely beautiful. I saw these and I was just like, yes. I hope you can see these. Um, this is the white, the pink, and the purple. They are just gorgeous. And I know, uh, I know Jeffree Star's coming out with colored highlighters. Um, and I was like, you know what? These could work as the same thing. They were $2.99. Yes. So that is both of the trios. That blue is just doing it for me. I love it. But isn't this pretty? I think these were just gorgeous standout highlighters. That Y is what I'm wearing on my cheekbones right now. And it works. It works, works, works. And it's also, I'm wearing this on my, on my eyes today. I just put the white, the pink, and then the purple. I did blend it out with a deeper matte purple, but it just works. So, if you see this, this would be my most highly recommended thing to get because it's just a standout product. You can use an eyeshadow, highlighter, anything you want, it works. The next products in the collection, that I want to talk about are the eyeliners. These are the Wet n Wild Mega Liner Liquid Eyeliner. This white one is called Trim with Lace, and the blue is called A Case of Blue. Um, I don't know if this blue is picking up true to color. It's like a corn, a cornflower blue. Is that what they call it? It's so gorgeous. So I didn't know how. Uh, pigmented these would be. I really didn't know what to expect. I have the white on uh, the inner part of my eyes right here. I'll do a swatch. I just did. So they turned out to be pretty pigmented. Really impressed with it. I got both of them to um, do double liner with. I haven't done it yet, but I'm really excited. Uh, to try to do some double liner. The white is probably not the most pigmented you're gonna get, but the blue is really, really pretty. I think the white is pretty um, just dabbed on the inner corner. It kind of brightens your eyes a little bit. There's also a pink in here. I just knew I wouldn't wear the pink. And these liners were $3.99. So good, affordable. You can't go wrong with wet and wild prices. And the last part of the collection are the nail polishes. There are four nail polishes in total. They are just gorgeous spring colors. Uh, what I have on my nails right now is Kiss My Mints. It is a beautiful mint color. I mean, um, I have worn these two already. This first one is Love Fest. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous pink. I'll insert a picture of it on my nails. I had it on for about five days. Great formula. I'm a fan of Wet n Wild's polish anyways. I love the brush. It's just the regular Wet n Wild brush. It's a really big brush. Um, it covers your nails. I mean, two, three swipes, your nail polish is done. I have only had to use two coats of these, so. The next one is Layout Lavender. It is just a beautiful lavender color. I can say I was a little disappointed. 
I thought it would be a little bit brighter on the nails. Um, it just doesn't stand out as much as I thought it would, but it's still a gorgeous color. And the last one in the collection is Breeze On By. It is very similar to um, the eyeliner color. Just that beautiful, beautiful cornflower blue color. This is the only color I haven't worn on my nails in the collection, but it will be put I put on my nails next. $1.99 a bottle, like so affordable, yes. So my top picks for the collection are nail polish, whatever nail polish suits you. They're all kind of pastel summer colors, um, very spring colors. I think they're gorgeous. I love the formula, it lasts great. And the other things in the collection I would highly recommend is the eyeshadow trio, the New Romantics. It is gorgeous. So that is the spring collection from Wet n Wild. If you've seen this collection out, what are your thoughts on it? Um, are you having a hard time finding it? I found it in two separate Walgreens here. So that wraps up this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.